taken his plastics to me. This is how Tarubi did it. He collected plastics polluting his surroundings and used it to make what he calls a low-cost bathroom tile. Put the plastics in the tray or frying pan, any mm -hmm. that you can put the plastic in. On top of it, you put the flammable liquid. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Then burn it <coughs> let it melt. After melting, he poured a handful of sand into it. The substance cooled off and formed a tile which he said can be used for flooring. A physics student, Leso Kago, said individuals can save time, limit the force and save energy when husking a dry coconut. This can be done by using this husker, an idea the students and their school principal, Mr. Noble, initiated. Everyone is, we are all one. So we are working together for a one goal only, that's the academic excellence. Two science students in grade 9 also surprised us with the homemade water heater. It may look a bit risky, but you will still manage to have a cup of hot tea. This is a homemade water heater. You can use it at home. Similar to Jack. Musi Laupan said they will continue to refine this model with other materials to make it more safer to use. We then crossed over to the social science section where we found Jack Homby, a legal study student. Homby went through all the legal procedures that must be followed when taking someone to court. The arresting officer prepares a court file. The arresting officer prepares a court file, then the court file is served on the defendant, then the matter goes to court. This was the first time Busu Secondary School organized an exhibition that allowed the students to showcase what they were taught in the classroom to the public. The funds collected will help build a four-in-one teacher's house. Julie Badui Owa, National MTV News, Lay.